everybody. Um, this is just a quick one on how to do the intro lead for Brown Eyed Girl by Van, uh, Van Morrison. Um, so it sounds like this. Um, it runs through that a couple of times at the start of the song and in between some of the verses. Okay, so the first thing we have is we're going to be picking with our thumb and our finger. We're going to be picking the G string and the bottom E string together like that. Okay, so we use our middle finger and our index finger for the first position. And that's index finger on the third fret on the E string. Middle finger on the fourth fret on the G string. And that's number one. Okay, so going from there we slide up to this one. That's middle finger, 5th fret on the G string. Ring finger, 5th fret on the E string. So you see it's best if you use middle and index for that first one, because when you slide up, it's just a matter of dropping that ring finger down onto the 5th fret there. So we have 4 and 3, 5 and 5. Okay, and the third one is 7 and 7. So that's middle finger, 7th fret on the G string. Ring finger, 7th fret on the E string. That gives us one, two, three. So we got three and four, three on E, four on G, five and five, five on G, five on E, seven and seven. Seven on G, seven on E. Then we just come back down through the other two patterns. So we go to position one, two, three, back to two, back to one. Okay, so the last aspect of this is the timing. Here there's a little bit of a stop after that third one before we come down and going from the second back to the first is quite a quick change. So steady going up, stop there and quick. Cool, so I'm just going to count to four and then I'm going to play that through four times so you can practice along. One, two, three, four. So that you can just rewind the video and um, keep going at it until you're comfortable doing it. Now we'll move on to the second part of the solo, which is exactly the same pattern, but it's shifted up a few frets. Okay, so this pattern is 8 and 9. So fret 8 on the E string, fret 9 on the G string, still using your pointer finger and your middle finger. Okay, then we go up to fret 10 with your middle finger, 10 with your ring finger. Okay, and the third position is 12 and 12. 12 with your middle finger, 12 with your ring finger. So you go 1, 2, 3. Okay, so the pattern's the same. Your fingers are here, index and middle, then middle and ring, middle and ring, and back down again. The rhythm's the same. So steady climb up, and then work back down on those two. Okay, so same deal, I'm just going to count four and then play that through four times so you can practice. One, two, three, four. Cool. Okay, so that's part two of the solo. Part three is the first part again. And the final part is a D chord. Okay, so you know the chord of D, that's index finger on 2nd fret G string, middle finger 2nd fret E string, ring finger 3rd fret B string, that's your D. And what we're doing here is we're plucking the G and the E strings together. Then we have the B string and the E string, just like that. Okay, so G and E together, B by itself, E by itself. Okay, so that whole solo goes first part, go 3, 5, 7, 5, 3, second part, 8, 10, 12, 10, 8, and then back to the first part, 3, 5, 7, 5, 3, and that D chord. Okay, so one more time, part 1, part 2, third part, same as the first.
Okay, so what I'm going to do is I'm just going to run through that four times for you to practice along to, uh, on the count of four. One, two, three, four. So uh, that's the intro lead to uh, Brown Eyed Girl by Van Morrison. Uh, happy strumming and I'll see you next time.